Hey, what's up guys, Jay Zib here, and today we're gonna be opening these two Divergent Power Tins. So last time I opened these, I opened uh, two of the Hisui and Decidueye ones. Now I got a Samurai and a Typhlosion. Um, it's just, these were like the, the random tins I had just kind of laying around. I still have a bunch of these, but I have like sets. These were just kind of scattered in different boxes. So I opened the two um, Decidueyes first, then these two. I'm in it for the Evolving Skies, but the Brilliant Stars and Astral Radiance are nice bonus right um i've gotten some good stuff from the brilliant stars and from the astral radiance in these 10 so far so hopefully um today i'll get some good stuff from the evolving size who knows i'm in it to rip it so yeah if you guys like content like this consider subscribing to the channel it's free for you and it helps me out immensely so thanks in advance for that i really appreciate it and without further ado let's get opening Hey guys, don't forget, every Friday I give away two JZab mystery packs to two lucky subscribers. So this week is no different. If you want to check out um, what video you have to comment on, check out this video right here. And then the next coming up Friday here, I will be giving away two uh, mystery packs. So stay tuned and hopefully you win. G good luck. And uh, now back to your regularly scheduled program. We're saving Typhlosion for last for sure. But yeah, so like I said, I'm in it for the Evolving Skies. There's two packs of Evolving Skies, two packs of Astral Radiance, one pack of Brilliant Stars in these. Which, I don't know about you, but that's a pretty good lineup if you ask me. The whole reason I have all these tins, I had a bunch... Well, I had a couple Divergent Power tins before, but uh, then Target had this sale where, man, they, they had these tins going for 20 bucks, right? And for two packs of Evolving Skies, two packs of Astral Radiance, and a pack of brilliant stars that's a killer deal so like any mad lad i bought a ton of these i bought a ton of these tins so there we go two astral radiance brilliant stars so yeah i did it for the evolving skies and the brilliant stars and astral radiance are good uh bonus content uh that came with it like i said the um the deal was like 20 bucks a tin basically and uh what am I doing? when you look at the fact that evolving skies is going for 10 bucks a pack right now it's basically two buying two packs of evolving skies that are sealed from the pokemon company and then getting to open two astral radiance and a brilliant stars as a, as a bonus so i just see that as an absolute win and uh yeah that's where i'm at that's where my mind's at let's hope we get some good stuff today cast form or man all right, nothing from the Brilliant Stars. That's okay, that's okay. Plenty of packs left to open and get some cool stuff. Yeah, I got some decent stuff uh, from these tins so far, so I mean, I'm not <clears throat> not upset that I bought them. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, like I said, this is like my last chance to really get Evolving Skies at a reasonable price uh, to rip open. And um, I don't know if you guys know me that well, but I just like opening Pokemon cards. Yeah, I'm in it to like kind of hoard some sealed stuff a little bit, but mostly I'm in it to rip it. I want to pull all my favorite cards from these sets. So, you know, if I can open some packs, I'm going to open some packs. And I haven't really gone out of my way to open a ton of Astral Radiance or Brilliant Stars on purpose. So that's why I'm pretty okay with these being the other sets in here. It's a pretty solid lineup, honestly. Um, Brilliant Stars, I, like I said, I don't really go out of my way to open. Astral Radiance has the Machamp V, which is pretty sweet, um, which I would really like. I'd really like to pull that card, so good sets. Good sets in these tins. That's all I got to say. Combi, Chatot, Psyduck, Drifloon, got a Bronzong. Ooh. All right, well, this tin has been a little rough. Let's hope Evolving Skies can save us. Uh, we shall see. I want to pull so many hits from Evolving Skies. Evolving Skies wants nothing to do with that. I'll tell you that right now. He's not a big fan of the plan that I just laid out for you guys, so. But Evolving Skies is a good set. It's so much fun to open. I enjoy it quite a bit. Very good Sword and Shield set. Okay, here we go. I can see something poking through the... Can you see it? What is it? Jump Bluff! Oh! Umbreon VMAX, let's go! 
All right, so first hit in the tin, and it's from Evolving Skies. Not bad, not bad. Not quite the Umbreon we're looking for. There's actually quite a few Umbreons in this set that I would like instead of this, but you know what? Still dope. I'll still take it. That's still a hit. Let's go. Uh, that makes me hopeful for the rest of these tins because now in the last set of tins, I've got a um, Leafeon VMAX and now an Umbreon VMAX. So that's pretty good. I'll take it. Evolving Skies is not easy to pull from. It's a it's a rough set to pull from. But let's go. And we still got another tin. We got one more pack of Evolving Skies. We got one more tin of packs to open. Come on now. Let's just let's just really get some good stuff today. That would be just great. Emolga. Woobat. Gossip Fluor. Phoebus. Hippopotus. Something about Spang Dragons. <laughs> okay. Bombing Skies. I know. I know, I know, I know. But you know what? Typhlosion's going to have all the hits. That was it from that whole 10. Five packs. One Umbreon. That's rough. All right, come on now. That's rough. Uh, but the Typhlosion's going to have the hits. I have a feeling. I have a feeling. And usually my feelings are wrong, so. <laughs> but we'll, we'll see this time. All right, we got our code card. We got our Typhlosion card, which is very sick, if you ask me. I really like the Hisuian Typhlosion, the ghost version. I think it's very dope. If you were to ask me which one I like better, regular Typhlosion line or Hisuian, I wouldn't even be able to answer that question. Ooh, Rayquaza. I wouldn't even be able to answer that question because they're both awesome. And, um... I don't know, you tell me, which do you think is better? Hisuian Typhlosion or regular Typhlosion? Or do you have a different favorite Arceus starter Pokemon? You tell me. Do you like Samurott better? That was backwards again. I'm just opening it backwards is what I mean, not that they're backwards. Every brilliant star so far has had that code card that direction. So what do you like the Samurott? Do you like the Decidueye? Do you like the Typhlosion? What's your favorite Arceus starter? Mine's the, mine's the Typhlosion. <clears throat> and it's it's by a mile. It's not even close. Tornadus. Bye, bear. This is actually a very decent card in the current meta. I don't know if you guys actually play the game, but Babero. People use it. People use it quite a bit. And that being holographic, pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, Astral Radiance. Your time to shine. Brilliant stars brought us nothing today. That's okay. That's okay. Last time it, it gave us a full art trainer card, so I'm not complaining too much. Curlia. Wait and see Turbo. Nicket. Togepi. Chetot. Magnemite. Teddy Ursus. Perogly. Alright, well. If we just go the same route as the last 10 and it's just nothing and then Evolving Skies give us a hit. Alright, I could get down with that, I guess. I'd still prefer every pack in the tin to give us a hit, but I could get down with just Evolving Skies, I guess. Alright, Astral Radiance, your last chance here for the day to give us a hit. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you're working with. Scyther. Stantler. Yanma. Hoot Hoot. Ooh, alright! I love Radiant cards, let's go! Radiant Heatran. All right, this is one I have not pulled a whole lot of because I haven't opened a ton of Astral Radiance. And in fact, I don't even know if I've pulled this before. I don't know. Anyway, I love the Radiant cards. I love the hatching on it. This coloring is actually really sweet with the orange and the red. And then I love the textures always in the Pokemon. It's very cool. Very awesome cards. I love them. I love them. All right, what else we got? That's fine. Uh, yeah, I'm struggling. I'm trying to think if i've pulled this before and honestly i'm not sure but i do love radiant cards so just a little jzab tidbit right there for you all right cool 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 all right here we go this is this is why we're here this is why we're here this is why we're here all right evolving skies don't do me dirty just hook it up just hook it up come on i'm i'm your i'm your biggest fan right and don't research that don't don't look that up but i am i'm your biggest fan 
just give me what I want and I'll leave you alone. <laughs> that's, that's, that's all I gotta say. Come on. Here we go. Low Ted. Stoutland. All right. <clears throat> Last pack. Last pack magic. Can we get it? It's a Rayquaza Evolving Skies pack. Come on now, you know you want to, you want to Fanta. It's just, it's just how the cookie crumbles. Let's go. Here we go. Last pack. I've opened a lot of Evolving Skies looking for the Moonbrion. I have. And I'm, I was hoping that during my travels, I would find like a Rayquaza. Haven't. I have not, not yet. All right, Swablu. Oh, all right. Well, hey, at least it's a hit. It's not quite a Moonbrion, but a Glaceon V. Let's go. I'll take it. I'll take it. Last pack. Last pack magic. All right. Well, 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 well. All right. Very cool. Very cool. That's three hits. Uh, Give me one second real quick. All right, guys. So here are our pulls from today. (sighs) The best one I definitely am going to say is the Umbreon V Max. Dope, 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 dope. And then we got the Radiant Heatran, also dope. Love it, love it, love it. And then the Glaceon. So three out of 10 packs, we got hits, you know, not bad. The promos are dope, pretty pretty cool, pretty good. I like these tins a lot because they have some really good sets and some good pulls. I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys did too. If you did, like the video, subscribe to the channel. If you want to subscribe, you can press this little button right here. It will subscribe you to my channel. And then I'm going to put two videos up top here. If you like the content, go check out some more. Lastly, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And until next time, I'll see you later.